Welcome to Back to the Bible. Jesus Christ dwelling with his people. Today's topic, Jesus Christ dwelling with his people. The baby was just lying there in a manger. The pain and humiliation of the birth were past. The pain and humiliation of life and death were before him. This was an interlude, a time of silence. a time of inactivity for generations he had ministered to his beloved people sustaining them speaking with them and sometimes appearing to them back in the garden of eden he had fellowshiped with adam and eve early on he had walked with enoch often he had conversed with abraham and moses he had met their deepest needs promising adam and eve a redeemer rescuing Isaac from Abraham's upraised knife treating Hagar with tenderness in the wilderness he had chosen leaders to save and protect his people and had commissioned them individually Moses Joshua and Gideon he had fought for them and pronounced judgment against influences of evil such as the serpent Cain Sodom and Gomorrah He had been there in person with his people sometimes visible sometimes not each time he had appeared before them he was preparing their minds for his coming each successive appearance added a few more strokes of the brush to the picture of the messiah who would come not as an angelic being but as a man in just a few short years he would be actively ministering to his people again this time as their substitute living a perfect life dying a sacrificial death and because of that we can now have a daily relationship with him which was unknown in ages past in all of this the appearances the incarnation his fellowship with us now we see a pervasive underlying truth Christ really wants to be with his people with you and with me and one day if we truly love him we shall see him face to face with no barriers no hindrances and we will be in complete communion and fellowship with him for eternity verse for today and i heard a loud voice from heaven saying behold the tabernacle of god is with men and he will dwell with them and they shall be his people and god himself will be with them and be their god revelation chapter 21 verse 3 your step for today select one of the appearances of christ in the old testament and write down what that even tells you about him prayer for today Thank the Lord for his presence with you today. Ask him to show you how he is preparing you for a future with him in eternity. God bless you.